Good morning, welcome to our ramble today. As you can see, we're going to be starting at Holgate's caravan site and then we're going to be walking on to Arnside. Now originally we were going to be going to Coniston but the weather's forecast is not good so we decided rather than go all that way and get wet through we might as well go to Arnside and get wet through. But anyway, we've got here, we've just parked up at the caravan park and here we are making our way now out of the site and making our way to Arnside Tower. Fifteen of us on the ramble today and the weather up to now isn't so bad but rain is forecast so we'll see what happens. But anyway we're making our way as I say through the site and then I think we're about to leave the site now, go down this lane and we should be finding a view of Arnside Tower very very shortly. picture when we get here. Oh, there we go. Have a good picture of it all. So, onwards and upwards as they say. Since last time we were here, they've made this bit of a small holding where we could have a look at animals. There's a hen there, just laid some chickens. So we obviously covering them up, we couldn't see all of them. a wooded area now, some very nice properties up here and then uh, we'll look out and you can see the viaduct very shortly and their views will be very nice from the houses Got quite a fancy van here, all we'll painted up so we're making our way down now into the town Oh yes, that's good. We'll have just have a picture here in this picture. There we go. Just have a bit of fun to it and off we go again. So now we're making our way down to the prom and then we're going to be turning left. But I think we're going to have our elevens is here. The train just going to go across the other side up there. Yeah, so while I'm filming that, we're actually having a little lovenses. At least Northern Rail are running that train. I'm not going to go on the bus. So that will be going to Wolverston and then on to Barrow, no doubt. So here we are. Now I'm setting up on the walk now. There's a couple of people we know from Morecambe, or the lady we know from Morecambe. Just have a quick word with her before we move on. So, up we go. I think we might have to go into the fields, I think, because I don't think we'll be able to get right round on the shore because the, uh, the tide was a high tide that morning. So, here we are. We end up in the beach again and uh, we're not going to go right round to the, towards the cafe, we're, we're going to turn off. I thought he'd throw a lump of wood for the dog, but the dog's not interested. And if you throw it, he'll go and get it. So we got to the end of the from bit and we've just been up the road a short way and then we turn right and into the, across this path and then we end up into a wood again. And I think that's where we're going to have our dinner. And that's where we're, the plan is because it's quite breezy and there is a little bit of rain. Something and nothing but uh, it could come on for heavier. So this looks a good place for dinner. So. There we are, dinner time.
very sheltered in here. No wind, you can hear it blowing through the trees, but it's uh, very nice. Oh, dinner time over and off we go again. Not what all those sticks leaning against that tree was, whether it's some sort of a tent or you, you know, youth club doing, I uh, don't know. But uh, that will just uh, put that into the video. Somebody might know what it is. So, on we go. We're going to turn right here and uh, aim towards um, Silverdale area again on our way back now. Just been having a laugh with these couple of people. So, um, long way. There's the bay and there's the caravan site in the distance. Oh, that's where we're going back to. Fortunately, the rain's held off, so we're not doing so bad. So oh, come out of that bit and then we're near to a farm now. Just making our way to it. Now this seems to have some animals what you can children can be looking at and viewing points and things in the wall. Very good. Now George decided he'll take these uh, these calves. Have a picture of him first, yeah, and then I think he's going to feed him. Well, he was doing. Come on, George, we've got to go. We can't stay here all day. Well, you um, make friends with these calves. Come on. Right, so now we can carry on again. So we uh, come out of this farm. Nice posh car there for all these hens. There's plenty of apples there to eat if they want them. But they're not supposed to be eating them. Anyway, we're making our way off the. So we've got to the end of there and uh, just cross the road and into the fields again. There we are, we're nearly back at the caravan park. So, there we go. Nice place to come and stay for a few of holidays. A swimming pool and a cafe and food shop and nice walks round about. Very close to the lake, so very nice. And those caravans are actually for sale there. So we're just making our way now back down to where the cars are parked. And that complex in front of you, that's where the swimming baths are and the, and the cafe. And we just turned off here and we went in an overflow car park they said we could park. So, hope you've enjoyed your time with us and we'll hopefully see you next week. So it's bye for now. <laughs>